during the holidays. Cut the Christmas music. <laughs> Cut the damn Christmas music. <laughs> My God. We just heard from Frank Minuccio. Apparently, Frank Minuccio's um, broadcast partner passed away. So, he's not going to be joining us today, folks. But, um, we had Robert Shane's die a couple weeks ago. Now this, uh, from the Vernuccio and Allison report has died. Damn. Damn. People dying? Dang. How do you make a transition into what I was going to talk about this segment? Oh, I got it. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not doing this to make light. Please. Please. I'm not doing this to make light. But earlier today... <laughs> earlier today... As everybody knows, I used to do this thing called Box a Buddy here in uh, Hutchinson, Kansas. Uh, I used to fight. I used to box. I did one, one MMA fight, sanctioned MMA fight. I did a lot of MMA fights in uh, in the old backyard in McPherson, Kansas. But I did a um. Did one MMA fight, did not do well. I'm more of a boxer. That's that's my thing. Well, as we all know, I lift weights probably three times a week with uh, uh, my buddy Rob Sabi, who you've, uh, he's never been on this program, but he's been on the Sunday show. Um, cousin Chris, of course, from Jiggy Jag TV. Jigman Freud Television! I really think I should have named it that back in the day. <laughs> But I lift weights every, ever uh, three times a week. Well, guess what? <laughs> we used to have a guy who lifted weights with us. Um, you might have. We've talked about him on this show a couple times. Sir Jeeves, the first knight of the empire. Well, Sir Jeeves um, has a new boss, as they say. The old boss is the new boss, and the new boss is the old boss, or whatever the hell that means. Or... J. Marie boss, or somebody's a boss, I don't know, doesn't matter. I need a boss, no, doesn't matter. I've got a boss, I think she's in Salina, though. But, um, <laughs> I, I, I hope all this is not lost on, on certain parties. But, um, so we have this, this, uh, this situation that has come about. Um, Jeeves, Jeeves posted something on social media today. Um, he made some comment about lifting weights or something, and he wants to look like this, this, this Adonis. Uh, he has this goal in life to have an eight-pack abs and all these things, which I don't want eight-pack abs. I don't want eight-pack abs because I like breads and pastas. It's never going to happen for me. But, as they say, so... um. Well, this guy that he works out with uh, posted uh, something on the old Facebook and basically, in a roundabout way, called me out. And as we all know, I don't like being called out, whether it's on the radio or in the gym. <laughs> so apparently next summer... Uh, I'm gonna try to schedule a boxing match with this guy. We're gonna just, we're just gonna strap on some gloves and we're just gonna see who the man is. Spoiler alert! It's me. <laughs> <laughs> that is one thing that I do not lose in, and that is boxing. I am getting ready to train my ass off. <laughs> talk about sparring, talk about focus bits, talk about lifting weights. Oh, you have no clue what you've done. So, 
and I, I added it up this morning. I've got basically six months to train for this guy because it doesn't get nice outside until June. Well, that's six months from now. Hopefully somebody will be here to watch that fight. If not, I'm going to tape it, put it on YouTube. It will be fun. It will be a blast. And I'll tell you, I haven't gone down yet, and I don't plan on it. <laughs> you better go find anybody and their brother to help you train for this. You better go, I don't know, better go pray to Jesus. I don't know what you need to do. Um, you better learn how to box, like yesterday. And you better learn how to hit like a Mack truck. Oh, wait, I've been hit like that before and it hasn't worked. All I got to say is I sure hope you've got, um, I sure hope you've got Jesus, Muhammad, and Jehovah on your side. Go get Hanukkah Harry. Go get Santa Claus. I don't care who you get. You better call up Hulk Hogan. I don't know who you're going to call. You better call Ghostbusters, for all I got to say. <laughs> oh, this is going to be fantastic. My body is not going to like this. <laughs> That's all I've got to say. <laughs> so, uh, get ready. Get ready. Oh, get ready. We're going to take a time out. It's top of the hour time. Oh, Christmas time in Hollis, Queens. Sitting on those rice and pork and beans, baby. It's getting ready to go down. It's getting ready to go down like two horny lesbians on a pimp in an elevator. Which I don't know how that works. I think I crossed my sings. Damn it. We're going to take a time out. <laughs> it's actually, it should be, the proper terminology is, get back on camera here. It's going down like a horny lesbian, or it's going down like two hoes on a pimp in an elevator. What I said was just wrong. We'll <laughs> be back after this here on the program. Hour number two, coming up. Check out one of our quality marketing partners at Transmedia Worldwide, Vaporator.com. That's the website you're going to need to write down. We'll spell it for you. V-A-P-O-U-R-A.